Welcome to a quick tutorial. This tutorial will be for the MI400K digital door lock, which is available from digidoor.co.uk. This door lock is also known as the Lavater door lock, and uh, we'll be looking at how do you register a single password with it, as well as multiple passwords into it. So, first of all, make sure that your door is in an open state so that you do not get locked out if you are following this tutorial and make sure that only once you are sure that your password is working and you're confident to be able to get into your house only then do you close the door in addition to this just uh, as you can register a password of four to twelve digits uh, make sure that you do make a note of your password that you are going to register and have a way that you can recover it. I suggest uh, you could perhaps email it to yourself or maybe even text it to yourself so that you have a way to recover it should you forget. So with those warnings out the way let's continue with this tutorial. So in order to register any pin code to this lock first of all you need to take the back cover off. Only somebody who has access to the back cover is able to register a pin code so that means uh, you need to be able to get into your house to be able to do this so over here there are two buttons the one which we are interested in is the one which is closest to this uh, round latch over here this one turns okay so the one which we are interested in is the 10 key, it's called the 10 key here and we need to press this one then we type in the pin code which we desire and then uh, you press the star button which is over here and then you press the, this uh, start button that will register uh, once you press the star button it will register it uh, when you press this button it will confirm that uh, you have finished registering it so let's uh, continue. I will just demonstrate. So I'm going to register 1234, which is a simple password, but this is just a demonstration. Okay, so that was registered. Now I confirm that that's uh, registered, that I wish that to be registered. So I press the start button. Now let's see how this works. So. As you can see, the lock is uh, in the lock position. So, if one, two, three, four. As you can see, that was registered. Okay. So, how do, how about if we register two passwords? So, uh, what if I want to register two, three, four, five? So, let's see. So, same way. And. Uh, that should be registered. No, let's just check that it was registered fine. Okay, I'm going to get out of displacement mode because I'm behind the camera. So, two, three, four, five. As you can see, that was registered. But I will show you that something's happened which you might not have realized. One, two, three, four is no longer registered. But in this lock, you can actually register up to eight passwords. So how do you do this? Well, every time I registered, I was pressing this button. But if you are registering a batch of passwords, uh, you don't press this button. Only you press it at the very end. So if you try to register a password uh, just by itself, the next time you try to register another one, it will uh, overwrite that the last one so only if you register a batch of of uh, passwords uh, do they enter into the lock so for example when we tried to register one two three four I pressed the star button and then I pressed the start button because I pressed the start button when I registered two three four five because I registered 2345 afterwards, that one was uh, only registered into the lock, not 1234. So uh, if I want to register multiple passwords, let me just demonstrate that. 
So I want to register one, two, three, four now. And I want to register two, three, four, five. And uh, that confirms that the batch is, is, con is uh, complete. So I could actually register up to eight. I just registered two in this case. But let's just uh, show that those two are both working. One, two, three, four works. Okay, both those simple passwords work. So that uh, really shows uh, how you register more than one password. If you just want to register one password, then you can just press the this button. But if you want to register more, then you press the star button. Then you register the next one, and then you press the star button until you come to the complete number that you want to register. And then you press this one. As well as... Uh, this you can also register the key tags but I don't have them here in this demonstration but it's the same process actually okay and uh, thank you for watching this uh, tutorial if uh, you want to see more tutorials like this do consider to subscribe to this channel and in addition to that uh, head over to the digidoor.co.uk website as uh, there's more information on this lock and other locks if you have any questions, do leave them in the comments and I uh, hope you can give us a thumbs up if it was helpful to you. Thank you for watching. Bye.